going on YouTube so we all know that the Swedes are very very crafty when it comes to storage so basically what's happening is uh, I've got four new tires I got to put on my car the rims are going to be the Klingon rims and those actually already have uh, tires on them so those tires have to come off in other words I need to pack eight tires four mounted to rims and four new ones that are not mounted to anything into my car can it fit well as I said we know that the Swedes are very crafty when it comes to storage so let's see how crafty Saab actually is can I fit four four unmounted tires plus four rims mounted with tires into the back of the Saab Lenium Falcon so the tires that I'm going to be getting mounted are the Iron Man iMove uh, Gen 2 AS. Uh, reviews are pretty good. Uh, traction on these tires is really good. Uh, the tread wear, it's not the greatest, but being in Canada, we don't have very long for very hot weather, so they should be good. And I have uh, four winter tires, which are still in 90% tread condition, so should be good to go. Um, these Iron Man tires are actually made by Hercules Tire, which is a third party uh, or third tier or second tier brand. Um, but as I said, the reviews on these tires seem to be very good in regards to grip, wet uh, traction and all that stuff. And so here is, uh, I'm that guy that runs the Klingons in the summertime instead of the winter. I just love the look of these rims on the SOPs. And that's why I do that. So let's see if this will all fit in the back of my car. So we've got two rims and tires, two rims and tires, and that stack of four tires. Let's find out. Swedes are crafty, eh? Crazy that much can actually fit in that trunk and the flip down back seat. Oh yeah. Anyway, if you like this video, leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe and you guys will see me on my next video. Peace.